So I'll call to order. Hello, everybody. Hi, Loretta. Um, hi. So just for the record, we could say who's here. This is Loretta J, the chair of the Disabilities Committee of the Human Services Commission. Linda D. Lorenzo. Laura Julie DeMarco. I'm sorry, I talked. Julie, you want to go again? Sure. Julie DeMarco. And Laura? Yes, Laura Inserto. Okay. So we'll call to order. And good to have everybody here. Um, let's see. One of our agenda is... Um, we, we do not, do we have minutes? Are there minutes on the October We do not meeting? have minutes. We do not have minutes. Okay. So, I should open up my um, agenda so I can look at it. I'm sorry. Um, there we go. Um, an update for the, our charge is since we met last, um, we shared the draft charge with Tom Bremer, who was sharing it with um, our first select person, Brenda Kupchik, and then it also was shared with the town attorney. Um, and we have not, I have not heard about any feedback. Julie, do you have any new, any new news? Yes, I did reach out to Tom Bremer yesterday just to find out where we were so that we could discuss it at the meeting. <coughs> And he said it's it's definitely still on the table. It's not it, the delay is not a reflection on the interest of be, having this become a commission, more of of a indication of an indication of the timing and the um, other things that are going on in town that require the attention of the town attorney. So he's hoping for by the end of December. Um, I will pursue that each week. I just figure. I'll just check in with him, um, but he still is very supportive. Great. So, and uh, this is Laura, Julie. Um, mm -hmm. So the Board of Select people have not met on this yet then? No. When they do, we'll know in advance so that we can attend that meeting. Um, and, I, and I think they would allow for, um, you know, I was, at, I was on a meeting last night and they allowed somebody who was an interested party on a town commission address the board, um, which is unusual during COVID time. So if we know in advance and request that um, Loretta, you as chair, address the, the board, I, I suspect that would work. But we will have time to know in advance and to attend. Great. Thank you. Mm -hmm. um, after it goes to, after it's reviewed by the town attorney, um, is there any other stops for the charge to go through prior, like any feedback? Has, do we know if, um, if Tom Bremer or, or the first black woman have, have already reviewed it and if they've given comment or feedback? I don't know that. That's a good question. I, I will ask that. I don't know. I know that once he reviews it, they'll probably have some edits, and then it would go before Board of Selectmen. Okay. Um, because in addition to the legal review, I would mm -hmm. think there's also some, some program review that they may want to contribute. Um, and we had left some questions open. So if there's an opportunity for discussion, um, or if, they would, if, if that would be appropriate. Okay. Yep, I, you know, I will reach out to him again tomorrow. Those are good questions I didn't even think of asking. Okay. And to that end, Loretta, this is Laura. Um, is there an update to provide to them as to interested parties that you've reached out to and have responded? Would that help at all? I don't know. So that's part of where, like, I would like to have a conversation with them as opposed to, like, a, a less formal discussion as opposed to this formal structure of a presentation to the Board of Selectmen um, that allows for some give and take and about participates, participants and um, even formulation of content on the, on the charge. Um, hmm. So I don't, I don't know if that's an opportunity, if there's going to be such an opportunity or not. Um, I don't know if it's but yeah, we have. I, we certainly can discuss, and I'd be very happy to share 
um, the status where we have a potential commissioners. Um, we're okay. still we still need more. I mean, I could I'm, we could talk about that today. It's part of our update um, about where we stand with that. And I expect that they're going to have their own people that they're thinking of mm -hmm. as well, um, who may be asked to join um, or submit. I mean, plus we want to put it out to the public and have the public be able to submit applications to join the commission for the selectmen to consider. Right. Right. I mean, there is a formal process. I understand um, why you would want to have a conversation that wasn't requiring a quorum or a you know or a formal meeting. Um, I just I truly don't know how that works. Um, right. So uh, so that those are some great questions that I can ask. Okay. How's it going, Julie? Are you doing well? Yeah. Yeah. I'm doing great. Good. Yeah. How about you? Good. Yeah. You and I need to have a call, I guess, according to Bernie. <laughs> With Bernie. Yeah. Which I was going to reach out to you today, set that up. Sounds good. So you'll report then, um, Loretta, on Thursday, right? Excuse me? You'll report this meeting for Thursday, right? Yes. Yeah. For next Thursday, yes. Yeah. yeah. Um. Let's see. Other other updates with uh, with the development of the commission. Um, I've talked with several people about um, about the commission, the development of the commission, or the committee developing into the commission, um, who are very interested in being involved. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything new since we spoke last. Um, no, no one really knew. We really, we're still looking to share information with, pe um, with people who might be interested if you know anybody. I think um, we have, you know, we need to be balanced between Republicans and Democrats, and unaffiliated can go on either side. We're a little bit heavy on the Dems, and we have um, one person who is a Republican who is, who is very interested in being involved. So if you know people and they want to chat, you could chat with them or send them my way. I'm all chat, happy to chat as well. Um, Sounds good. Okay. Um, it's it's um, Julie again. I just had a, one more point to make about the um, charge for the com new commission is once we get that back from town, we need to have the Human Services Commission vote on it. Right. Because right. we didn't do that yet, right? No. So it can't go before the Board of Selectmen until um, this committee votes and approves the charge and brings it to the Human Services Commission. Right. So, so we're I not like, like that going to happen. Would you do that until... this coming Thursday? No. Do we no. vote on it this Thursday? No. Oh, we haven't got it coming. back yet. Yeah. Oh, you um, want it so back with the doesn't... corrections and stuff. Exactly. Or the edits like we... or whatever. Yeah, I think it's unlikely that anything will happen until the new year. I agree. Sorry about that. Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. Um, then also wanted to, I thought it would maybe nice to sort of talk about a recap of all that the Commission has accomplished, and not necessarily as a baton toss, but but sort of to make sure that we're remembering and highlighting the all the great work that this group has done for the past couple of years. I I um I had a lengthy chat with Chris Burbank yesterday, who says hello to everybody. Oh, um, I love her. And yeah, and it was um. And anyway, so it was just nice. To, it was good to ca good to catch up, but um, talk with her about the the beginning parts of the commission. And but really, um, Laura and Linda and Julie, the three of you have been around with the group from the beginning, um, where I have not. And it would be I think it would be nice that we sort of have a recap if we want to sort of throw out like brainstorming sessions to sort of put everything down and all document it. Things that you want to make sure that. 
are are reflected in our history, the highlights. How does that sound? Great idea. Okay. We'll do whatever you want, Loretta. Well, why don't you, can you just sort of share some of the things, like what? Oh, you mean you want to talk about today? Oh. Well, we yeah, were like really good about it. Aren't we had a lot of meetings. And how we got to where we got to, What? Get, be more specific well, about what you would like. So, Laura, when you think about the commission, what do you feel is the biggest accomplishment beyond, uh, what, do you, what do you feel like was the most work and the mo biggest accomplishment that you want to highlight? I think just the fact that Chris Burbank brought this to a recognition point that none of us had ever thought about. I think that, you know, we all always think that things are done, right, and taken care of, not recognizing that this was a huge um, need in the town to focus on. And, and as a Human Services Commission, I mean, I've been on the Human Services Commission four years, and I've never thought about it. So the fact that she was able to articulate the need and have the enthusiasm and follow through to get to where we are right now, to me, is the most significant part of all my work on this. Okay. Linda, how about you? I think, too, that, um, you know, we, we had a lot of smaller meetings where we brainstormed. Uh, she was able to pull in um, – See, this probably goes back before you, Julie. We had some guest speakers. I mean, and when we were a small group, when there were only two or three of us, like we mm. had the gentleman from Westport come in and tell his story. Uh, we yeah. did a lot of, re you know, we, so we had guest speakers to learn different things. We had him and we had a state woman who came to see us too. I can't remember who she was. We also did, uh, we did research other, on other towns. We each took a few towns and talked to them about why they have a, a disability group, how they got started with the pros and cons, and, and we got some good ideas of the kinds of things they were doing. And I thought, too, that our stakeholders meeting was excellent. Were you there for that, Julie? Um, I attended it, but I didn't really jump in until Terry retired. So this, yeah, this so it was is definitely the work Terry, that you did. Right. That me. stakeholders meeting, there was a lot of information sharing, and there were a lot of people there um, yeah, from different facets. One, you know, we we yeah. sort of got the ball rolling a little, but then you know everything happened. Oh, the other thing was Chris did a lot of good. Um, well, you probably have them PowerPoints. Yes. Oh, she did. She, was, she did a she couple of PowerPoint amazing. presentations. Yeah. So it who did those just, presentations go to besides Mike Petro? Who else received? Who else was the beneficiary of those presentations? We shared them at the uh, at the uh, stakeholders meeting. Okay. So that was. I mean, a lot of people. There were people from uh, agencies. People. In the community, right. people with All the disabilities. People at that they, they, they got that as well. Okay. Do you have those, Loretta? I, I believe that I do. I have a couple of PowerPoints, so I have yeah, to go back and Yeah, that would be achieved exactly too, yeah. Okay. Um, how about the Julie? survey? Oh, that's right. We did the survey. What Was that the students, I think? We had the Sacred Heart students do that? Right. Yeah. What did you take away from that survey? Do you, is there anything that, that stands out to you as most memorable? I'm trying to think. I have a feeling that hmm, somebody tallied all of that. Um, I mean, not only did the group tally it, but I'm just trying to think who presented it to the commission. Uh, it I, might feel like that Bernie. A, I think Bernie took the lead on that. Right, and Sacred Heart did a um, like case study or a, um, what are they a capstone project? Remember that? <clears throat> oh, that was a long time ago. Yeah. 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 I know one of the studies that was done. Bernie that decided to put it on the computer or try to, you know, make some statistical data out of it. 
I think it was Bernie. Was, was the capstone project senior? separate or related to the yeah, survey? Yeah, that was separate. I thought that was more. Yeah, that was senior. separate. This was another survey. Yeah. I think. Yeah. Yep. The one we okay. did with the Sacred Heart um, intern was for seniors, not necessarily the disabled. Oh, which one was that? That was the um, the capstone project. Yeah, no, I yeah. think it was. I think it was both. I'm going to see if I can find the results. And you know what else I'm thinking about? Wasn't there a, a an older woman, a graduate student, and she did something special? Yeah, that that was for seniors. That was a seniors survey. It wasn't for disabled. Oh, it wasn't for disabled. Oh, okay. No, no. I don't remember what we sent out for disabled, honestly. I have to go back and look I think there were folder. two. I think we sent out one survey with Chris and then one survey that Sacred Heart did. I might be wrong. There was, there was, yeah. there was here I can pull it up. There was a survey um, with Sacred Heart for people with disabilities. Because that one I've gone through the findings, so I remember... Um, was there one the committee did way, way at the beginning a real simple thing? Bernie might, Bernie might know because he was involved in that. Did Bernie used to be on the Disabilities Committee? I think no. so. No. He wasn't? He wasn't. No, he wasn't. He okay, was obviously probably. in the loop being the chair of the Human Services Commission, but he didn't come to the disability. I thought, and I mean, in the days of... Uh, Chris? Yeah. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Okay. You know, Linda, your okay. memory's probably a lot better than mine. I doubt it. I'm going soft because I don't have enough <clears throat> stimulation in my life. Well, I was going to say, as far as 2020 goes, mine is just... Mush. I'm I know. Sorry. Terrible. I can't deal. Yeah. Been, it's the only good thing you. is I've been writing. At least that gives me writing to people. I've been writing oh, letters good. instead of sending Christmas cards. Oh, good. Okay. Uh, only a few. I forgot about the Christmas cards. It's I'm too old for it now. But One more. I wrote thing a few I want really to add. good long letters. <sighs> One more thing I wanted to add to our list was we um, we also had a, a session of brainstorming. I'm sorry, let me close the door from the dogs. Um, <laughs> every time a delivery person shows up. Um, that we had a brainstorming of potential activities for the committee slash commission to take on. Um, mm that we, would, we just sort of we brainstormed the types of, you know, areas of need and where we can get involved. Um. I remember we had one session with uh, Chris where we talked about, you know, no money or low-hanging fruit or whatever. And right. we had gotten a lot of good ideas from other towns, so we made a little list that day, I know, of maybe three or four things we could do. See, I'd have to look it up. I'd have to look up my old files. I'll look, I'll look and, and um, see if she shared that one with me. We have one that when I was involved that I have a list. But um, maybe we, Loretta, it's Julie. Maybe we could put this on the agenda for next month and everybody bring a list of accomplishments and, um, you know, maybe the supporting documents that go with it because all this paperwork is out there, but it would be great to yeah, have I mean, it. Yeah, I have a whole – big folder, but I just haven't gone through it. So, oh, my Linda, if you're so... able to do that in some, in some, creating some sort of a, if you have them digital, to, to share them digitally, that would be great. Um, so, Julie, that's a great idea. To, to, uh, Go if through we all can, the old stuff and see what we, we can really come up with. we can really formulate what we've got and create a library of material for reference and to help with the baton passing, um, that would be very useful. Now, um, do you have an actual slate 
Loretta, like I know that Nee is interested in serving. Um, so it's you and me, correct? From this group. And then there's a, yeah. there are several other people who are interested in being involved. Um, but they haven't, since there's no commission yet, they are not in a position to submit their names. Um, Got it. But, there's, but we do have, besides me and myself, we have one, two, three other people. So that's five altogether who are interested. Oh, that's good. That's great. That's awesome. Did you um, talk to Alder? I did. Alder is eager to get involved. Yeah, he'd be great. Good. He'd be Actually, really good. Right? One, two, yes, yeah, three. So there's five of us. So, um, I, one, two, three, four. Yes. Um, so, so that's great. And the diversity of of the, of the five people's experience is also really nice. There's training, there's public health, there's marketing, needs an attorney, um, and I'm program development or evaluation. So it's a nice combination of skill set um, that yeah. could be really beneficial. Great. Um, but we're still, you know, and, and we'll put it out to the public as well, and hopefully we'll get more people. Well, um, you don't need a huge okay. Any other, is there other business that people would like to discuss? No? I didn't hear what you said. I asked if there's any other business that people would like to cover. Oh, oh. Okay. Um, nothing else? No, I think your update was good. Okay. Terrific. Thank you. I don't have anything Happy else. Happy Hanukkah, honey. Thank you. Yeah. I'm, I'm just sure that it's right. Hanukkah the fact today? that it actually is. Here, let's yeah, adjourn yeah. and then we can chat. Um, so I'll, I'll adjourn at 427. All in favor? Perfect. Hi. Oh, oh perfect. yes. Okay. Second. So thank you, Laura. Um, yeah, Hanukkah took me by surprise, like an hour ago. Oh, so you weren't, like, <laughs> totally on it. There you yeah. go. So not. You've been busy. You've been busy. Yeah. It's a good thing that Barbara had her email yesterday saying she wasn't going to make it today for, for, for her candlelight, because that's what alerted me to the fact that it really was today. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Barbara, she's so good. Okay. It was nice chatting with everybody. You and too. We'll be in touch when we have more information on the charge, and we'll we'll give an update to the to the full commission next week on Thursday. Okay, great. Sounds great. Thanks, Loretta. Thanks, everybody. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Right, bye. Everyone, have a good night. You, you too. too. Bye. Bye. Bye.